Uh, hello, Asmongold fans. Welcome to my stream channel. This clip is going to go up on YouTube, so if you're on YouTube already watching it. Hi, guys. Um, um, Asmon's on the grind farming reaction clips, so I'm uh, on the grind re uh, grind farming Asmon reaction or reactions to Asmin clips. No, I it's just I think it's a really good way too to like see stuff around the internet. There are al uh, internet amalgamators, which is I think a valuable setup on the internet and whatnot. Um, but yeah, anyways, I'll give you guys a little bit of context on the drama here. Just before we get into the video, uh, Pokemon, huge, huge content creator, one of the biggest content creators on the internet at the moment, the biggest streamer on the internet at the moment, has released some cookies. That people found at Costco uh, for like half the price less, Pokemon and then she had a response, which I find actually pretty funny. It's I don't know if it's too much drama or anything like that. Ah, uh, we're not going to be a drama channel, don't worry, guys. It's not going to be that. It's just this is blowing up all over my Twitter feed, my news feed, my everything. Out with an apology about this. I uh, saw this earlier. She goes. Uh, while what I said was 100% intended to be a joke, I can see why it came off as insensitive, and I apologize for that. I also understand that the current price of the cookies may be expensive. Oh, wait, this is the apology. Hold on. No, we need the actual so, video. So, Pokimane, uh, responds to the price of the cookies. <laughs> I'm like, oh my god, $28 for cookies? It's four bags. That's seven seven dollars a bag i know i know math is hard which seems to be a trend i'm going to point out of content creators buying products jacking the price of the product way way up and reselling it basically as a uh um i don't know as a con as a sponsored content product but i, I want to point out in contrast too mr beast seems to have done an excellent job of not doing that mr beast has been like the flagship guy to go in terms of like sponsored products because he's actually making quality products as far as i know i've only actually well i've seen and i, I haven't had a mr beast chocolate bar at all but i've had a beast burger from one of those beast burger places and it was really good okay and it was not too expensive right but the issue here of course is that pokemon is selling something for more than double the price i'm pretty sure when you're an idiot but uh... Like if you're a broke boy, just say so. Oh, yeah. Anyway. yeah, so like obviously all the broke by boys in chat of her stream were so mad that they clipped it. But you don't really want to like see that's really bad and like it's it's super out of touch to say that. It's dumb as fuck to say that. It's I don't a know little why out of touch. Say that. Like I have no idea why you would say that. It might make her feel good to say something like that. It definitely probably felt good for her to say something like that. Because, like, some of the criticism that she got was, like, I would say it was a, it was an 11, right? And it should have been, like, an 8. It was a bit over the line. But the truth is that... The criticism that she got should have been, like, a 4. And it was it came out as, like, a 10. You, you just can't... You can't go out and, and, and say this shit, right? You just can't. Yeah. It, like, your customers are right there. Like, imagine... If any high-end product put out an advertisement and they're like, if you're broke, get the f*** out of here. Like, you know, like it's, it's not a very good look.